Wealth is one thing, power and status is another. Many in the merchant class have become rich, but the merchant class is a large step below nobility. Merchants, no matter how wealthy, cannot become samurai. This caused many merchants to lust for the power they were officially denied, few more so than a man named Ichigoya. Ichigoya began his career as an honest trader, but before long his rivals began to turn up dead, and Ichigoya expanded into protection loan sharking and gambling. His methods are brutal, his profit fast. If arrested, Ichigoya would simply bribe his way free. You must make him pay for his crimes with his life. Come on, come on! <laughs> yeah! What? Who are you? I'm here to avenge all the innocent people you've hurt. Somebody help! Get him! Get him! It looks like you chose the wrong party to crash. My business is with Echigoya. Step aside, or I will have to kill you. <laughs> Echigoya, where have you hidden? Get away! Help me! Somebody! <laughs> Your bodyguards are dead. And you are next. My money! My money! Your greed sickens me. I hope your death is a lesson to others. A large and well-organized group of outlaws intends to attack Lord Goda's territory. You have stolen a copy of their plans. If these plans are delivered to Lord Goda, his forces will crush the outlaws at little cost. Without the plans, Lord Goda faces a brutal fight. The enemy has sent a group of ninja to the town outside your lord's castle to stop you from delivering the plans. Elude or destroy these enemies and get the plans to Lord Goda. I sense danger. I'd best hurry. Please forgive my late arrival.
No, no, you have done well. Lord Gorda is waiting for you. Come. One of Lord Goda's ninja was captured while undercover in a hostile territory. The missing ninja is in a torture chamber deep under a dangerous forest. With orders to immediately free the captive, Lord Goda has released you from the ninja code, which forbids rescues. You must free the captive, and quickly. So, the mice come out to play. That means you get to play too. You can't play no more. Die in peace, you misguided soul. <laughs> I must say, I'm impressed. Who's that? I am Onikage. I shall eventually come for Goda and your heads. Until then, become a more worthy opponent for me. <laughs> you took your time getting here. I beg your pardon? I guess you deserve a thank you this time? Years of bloody civil war have ended in a fragile truce. It is a time of peace, but the threat of attack is constant. Death and destruction is the price for complacency. Ever vigilant, Lord Goda sent you to spy on suspicious movement in a potentially hostile neighboring territory. Lord Goda's worst fears are true. This neighbor intends to attack with an army of 20,000 men. Lord Goda must be informed. You rush back towards his territory under the cover of darkness. Near the border, you come across an enemy checkpoint. There is no way around it. You must get through the checkpoint and deliver your report. Please stop, right where you are. You seem to be in great haste for such a late hour. Where are you going? It's a beautiful night. You should be looking for a boyfriend, not playing with your dad's weapon. How dare you speak to me like that? I'll teach you some manners. I have failed. Hm. If you worried more about your skill and less about my manners, you'd still be alive. Now all I have to do is make it to the other side. What? A little girl like you defeated my dear sister? I just gave her a little lesson in manners. And you're next. No! In today's lesson, you'll learn how a Miljin Soga master uses swords to avenge his sister. Tazu! I cannot avenge you, dear sister. I failed as a brother and as a warrior. Brother and sister, huh? Your parents must not have done a very good job. Following his death, Ichigoya's ledgers were thoroughly examined. The investigation revealed a link between the merchant and a man called Kataoka, Lord Goda's finance minister. Kataoka is abusing his position, accepting bribes in return for assigning city construction projects and similar favors. Kataoka happens to be the son-in-law of Sekia, one of Lord Goda's most trusted advisors. Lord Goda knows the truth and could have Kataoka arrested, but does not want to bring unbearable shame on Sekia. Understanding his master's dilemma, Sekia has decided to resolve the matter himself and orders you to execute the corrupt finance minister. Minister Kataoka sure likes his money. What is this, Bizenya? 
There is more here than usual. We could not do business without you. <laughs> the money is merely a token of our appreciation. I like the way you think. What can I help you with today? We have put in bids for the construction work next month. If you could only... Leave it to me. <laughs> but remember what happened to Echigoya. Tread carefully. <coughs> hey you, where's your boss? You, you're Lord Goda's ninja. How convenient of you to come here. I have orders to kill you. Wait! Please, spare my life. Hmm, make you a deal. Tell me where your boss is, and maybe I'll let you live. The m m master is out. He, he, he should be back soon. <laughs> Lord Goda trusted you. How could you betray him? I may have made mistakes, but I allow no women to scold me like that. You shall die by my arrows. Your arrows are like you, weak and twisted. I fear them, not... What? How could I have lost? You stole from Lord Goda. How could you have won? Long ago, an evil spirit was trapped in a magical stone. This stone has the power to control minds and alter bodies. It has been stolen by a strange cult, calling itself the Manji. The Manji are using it to go from temple to temple, slowly building an army of zombie-like followers. Soon, they will start attacking villages, then towns, then cities. You must recover the stone and terminate the cult before it's too late. I know what you want. You want a stone. It's safe inside my belly. You're not going to get it. <laughs> you use the stone to hurt people. I will take it, even if it means gutting you. My... My, my precious stone. Burn in hell, you heretic. I found the somewhat amusing. We meet again. Onikage, so you're behind this too. Come on. <laughs> you're brave, but who? You will die. I underestimated you. Next time, you die. <laughs> Japan has opened its gate to the outside world allowing foreign trade for the first time in nearly 200 years. Together with silk, gunpowder, and exotic spices have come something less desirable, foreign pirates. And none is worse than the Spaniard, Captain Balmer. Under the cover of the ship's powerful cannons, Balmer and his crew have wrecked havoc on the town. You must destroy these barbarians and restore peace. ¿Deseas que te maten? ¡Muérete! Expect no mercy. Your life is over. ¡Ay, Dios mío! It must be sad to die so far from home.
Lord Goda's only daughter, Princess Kiku, is quickly losing her sight to a mysterious disease. All conventional efforts to treat her have failed. However, there is a magical herb that grows only at the top of Mount Sheba. This herb has the power to halt the disease and restore the princess's vision. You must fight your way past the demons guarding the mountain, find the herb, and deliver it to Princess Kiku. So this is the herb. Princess, I'm on my way. Last night, a creature calling himself Omikage led an army of ninja-like demons on an attack against one of Lord Goda's castles. Onikage and his servants have strength far beyond that of ordinary men. They were able to quickly overwhelm the guards and kill all of the castle's residents. Onikage is now making preparations to invade the town. He must be stopped. The castle is heavily fortified and well defended. A frontal assault is impossible. You must infiltrate the castle and eradicate the enemies from within. You have done well to get here. Lord Mayo will be so impressed. So, Onikage, your Lord Mayo is behind all this? <laughs> What does it matter? By now, your Lord Goda's castle will have been breached, and you shall die here. What? He's gone? While you were chasing Onikage in the castle, Meo, the king of hell, kidnapped Princess Kiku, Lord Goda's only daughter. Lord Goda and his advisors are too shocked by the kidnapping for any thought or action. With Princess Kiku as a hostage, Meo's evil power is unlimited. You are Lord Goda's only hope. You must rescue the princess and destroy Meo. I see. You have come to meet your fate. So, you've returned. This time, you won't come back. <laughs> oh, you can't beat me when I try. We'll find out. Stop! You have won. Your princess kick is held below. Guarded by Lord Mayo himself. I will see you in hell. Onikage, I destroyed you. And your master Mayo is next. Tell me where Princess Kiku is. <laughs> Do not concern yourself with the girl. Think about saving your skin. No! This cannot be. A mere human! Huh? 
All of Lord Goda's enemies die by this blade. Rikimaru! Princess Kiku, you're safe. Ayame saved me, but I was scared. Nikimaru, it's dangerous here. We'd better get out. Mm. This looks bad, Ayame. Come on. Kiku! Cool. 